All right, guys, it's day two, 10 days, 10 shaves with the DE Safety Razor. And I want to thank everybody for voting. And you guys voted for the Vanderhagen short, which is very interesting to me because this was actually the first DE Safety Razor I ever used. And why? It's readily available out in CVS or any of the box stores. Uh, one of the, the viewers commented about that. Very easy to get this. Um, at a low price point and just it has a nice look to it. It's chrome and it's a good beginner's blade. It's got the butterfly open and the kits come with their own Vanderhagen uh, ice tempered steel blades. So that's what I'm going to go with today. And I'm also going to be using the Perazzo shave foam. We're going to do it pretty simple. Now, I was tickled with one of the comments that I got this week. And I'm gonna be giving away a product, but you're gonna have to watch and find out who got this product and why you got it. This right here is a Gillette gift set that I purchased a couple of Christmases ago. It's sort of been sitting, I'm a little bit of a hoarder and a sucker for marketing, but it's got this nice handle, nice hefty white handle, and it comes with, it's a fusion with the flex ball technology and it comes with a Fusion Pro Glide um, shave gel. So this is going out to a lucky viewer, and we'll we'll talk about that at the end of the video. I'll also be giving away one of these Vanderhagen razors today. So I took all of the votes for the last two videos, I put them in a fishbowl, and I'll be doing a drawing live later today or tomorrow and I'll announce who is going to be getting this guy. All right, let's get cracking. Really like this Perazzo shaving foam. Has a nice muted smell and goes on nice. Not super thick, which is what I like. Today I'll try a with the grain pass and a cross grain pass. Again, I'm gonna be shaving for the next eight days after today. And I don't, I don't wanna stress my skin out too much. So first pass, as you know, if you come here often, I'm gonna be shaving with the grain. So the hair on my face grows down, I'll be shaving down. Short strokes. Minimal to no pressure, 30 degree angle. And it's very nice guys. This short handle is, doesn't have a lot of heft. but it feels nice and nimble in the hand. And it's a nice mild Razor, again, good for those of you who are looking to start wet shaving. Take your time with it. Very, very nice. And there you go. Face done. So now on your neck, your hair on your neck grows upwards. We're going to flip the blade around and we'll attack the neck.
Again, nice short strokes, flipping the blade, double edge, you have two of them, why not use them both? Very, very nice. No problems, guys. Shaving around the Adam Dapple today. So just pulling the skin to one side and shaving around it. First pass in the books, guys. Now we'll go with the second pass again. I'm gonna do two passes as opposed to the three I would typically go with because I'm living in isolation, guys. Where am I going, right? I don't need a super, super, super close shave, but this does a good job. So now I'm gonna load up with some more warm water and a little bit more of the Perrazzo. Because the one thing I would say is the Perrazzo has a tendency to dry up, especially if you're talking like I do. But it's a nice soothing feel to it. Almost like a chalky feel to it. But I enjoy it. Earthy, it's got an earthy feel, guys. You could apply this with a brush, but I'll do some brush. I'll do some brush and soap lather in this series. I keep promising that, but I will get to it. All right, so a cross grain cut is typically what I would do for my second pass and then I would do a, an against the grain. But we're gonna just do two, so I'm gonna do today a cross grain cut. And with the cross grain cut, you still wanna use the same technique, about a 30 to 35 degree angle. Short strokes, light to no pressure. You're not digging guys, you're shaving. and you're taking your time, especially near the sensitive bits. You wanna take your time. You're not in a rush. And that's the beauty of the DE shave. It's really for folks that like the, really kind of enjoy the process of shaving, in my opinion. If you're in a rush, you can't beat a heavily protected cartridge razor, like your Gillette Fusion or your Chic Hydro series or your Mach 3, whatever. You really want to just take your time with this and enjoy it. Flipping that blade. Minimal pressure. Very, very nice razor, guys. And one of you, lucky viewers, who voted on the first two videos has an opportunity to win it during a live session later. And you don't have to be there to win it. I'm just gonna pull a name out. But it'd be nice if you're alive later. All right. 
there we go. Now, if you wanted to at this point, you could feel around to see where you might have missed. I tend to always miss up in here. So you'll go back and, you know, address those areas. But pretty good. And again, I'm going to be shaving for the next eight more days after this, after today. So I don't want to push my skin. The cold water to close the pores after the shave. Really nice, no irritation, no nicks, no pulls, tugs, no weepers today. The Vanderhagen Short Handle, very nice razor, especially for you beginners out there. I'm gonna leave links in the description box below for all the razors I'm using in this series. So if you're not the lucky winner and you're interested in it, you can pick it up on Amazon. You'll be doing something for you and you'll be doing something for me. Now let's get to the giveaway. Let's give, get to the giveaway today. Again, I'm going to be giving away one of these Vanderhagen short blades and I'll do that later tonight during a live drawing. But for this, guys, I was tickled by one of the responses and I'm going to be sending this out to a guy who really just showed me enthusiasm, not only for the channel, but enthusiasm for his family. And this Gillette gift set is going out to my boy, Nick 8BP, because his brother, Hunter, 1238BP, was actually the first winner of the Gillette Heritage Razor. And the story is that Hunter123 has been a viewer of my channel for a while now. He's always on lives, always enthusiastic. And one day during a live session, he said, hey, my brother Nick is here. I actually introduced him to your channel and now he's a subscriber. And Nick has been watching the channel. So when Hunter won, Nick said, or Nick's comment was, congratulations, you know, Hunter is my brother, I'm, I'm happy for Hunter. And that kind of just touched me because he was just really genuinely excited for his brother. And I know how that goes when you have siblings and one, you know, might get a gift or something. And, you know, the, the first reaction could be, uh, I didn't win. But the genuine happiness for his brother just kind of tickled me. So Nick, because you're a good man and a new subscriber and you love your brother, I'm going to be sending this out to you, brah. I'll be sending it to the same address unless you tell me otherwise. So enjoy it. Again, for each and every one of you who voted over the last two videos, again, later I will be doing a live drawing to give out this Vanderhagen short handle. We'll do that live. So I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. I will definitely see you tomorrow. And in the meantime, you know what to do. Keep pushing play. All right.